Welcome to episode 10 of the Pack to Glory. And this is going to be the last episode of Foot Birthday. This is how we're starting today's episode off with them seven special cards in the team. Can we get any more? We have the homegrown 11 games and rewards in this episode. But we're starting with the daily login upgrades, the 12 out of 12 rewards, which is the 85 times 5. If you have enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And let's get into the packs. Right, Rem, uh, 281 plus. We've got a walkout. Don't be a dupe. Don't. Hey, Tony Cruz. I think we've already used him. I think we've used him, so he should be in. We haven't used him. Ah, he's a duplicate. So, seeing we do actually have the year in review player pick, so we are going to go and put Varela and Cruz in there. So, let me quickly build the team and we'll be right back. Right, to get the 86 rated squad, we are going to have to give up an already club legend in Kingsley Coleman. 16 games played he scored a lot more than that but that friendlies hasn't been picking it up but this is the team we're going to do cruise in there the barella in there and then we'll quick tell recovery barella so we're going to submit that coleman gone let's get into the rest of the pack so we send tony cruz back into the club because we just used him i need to remember to go and get barella back primal extras players pack from that no walkout or anything. No board. More fodder just to go into a club. And then we need to grind some of the 80 plus upgrades. I think we'll do by before the end of the week. Maybe save them for the next promo. We had two foot birthdays this, this week. But we've had Pacina twice. <laughs> and then we got Onana, didn't we? So, right, here we go. Here's a big pack. 82 times, 85 times two, sorry. It is a foot birthday. Don't be Italian. packed him three times now we've packed him three times none of the others just Pacina three times and Busquets come on 85 times five for foot birthday it's an inform <sighs> the barley I mean he gets Ken from thingy <sighs> to Stegen Rodri and Malinkovic Savage and another duplicate Tony Cruz year in view pack Gordon for the third time Cruz, the duplicate going in there. And then let's get into the year in review player pick. Here we go. One of four. We've had Mkhitaryan and we've had Bora in this so far. Can we get a decent pull? Come on. Diaby. Diaby's absolutely ripped me apart a few times when I played against him. We're going to take Diaby. Definitely, definitely there. He's going to be a good super sub to start with. But before we put Diaby into the squad, we're going to complete the foot 19 and the foot 22 SBCs to get them a couple of extra tokens. So hopefully we can get an 82 times 20 and perhaps an 81 times 11 as well. So we add Diaby and Tabali into the team on the bench for now as we get into first owner Fiesta to get them extra packs. Let's get into the gameplay. As we head into game number one, we end up going behind to start with for the first game of first owner Fiestas. A bit of a stupid own goal. But either way, we went behind. Fortunately, though, Forland goes up the other end and does what Forland does, and he puts it in the back of the net. We then go ahead through Ossimhen after 15 minutes, and it doesn't take long after that for my opponent to then quit, giving us an easy first game win. Into game number two, we get the lead again, 20 minutes in, the through ball to Bora, round the keeper, easy as you like. We then double our lead through Ossimhen to go 2-0, and I was hoping for an early rage quit. Unfortunately, it never came. It got back into the game. 4-4. In injury time, I thought the attack had gone, but we kept it alive. Ossiman, quick passing with Forlan, pulled back for Forlan, and he puts it home. 5-4 winner for game number two. Unfortunately, then, going into game number three, we were able to get an early rage quit. One minute in, I go forward with Forlan. Power shot, a cross goal, 1-0. And it does get a rage quit. Then, fortunately, back to back, we took the lead very early on. And we get another rage quit. The pause button pressed even before we scored. And then the rage quit comes. Into game number five, we did take the lead. And I thought, get in, another win under the belt. But unfortunately, we did lose 5-2. We do include the losses, not just the wins. So yeah, we don't win every single game. I'm not that good. But going into game number six, we then take the lead again. Batman Diego Forlan. I'm so happy we got him. And 
the rage quit came as we took a 5-1 lead through awesome men yeah pause button you know the drill i'm a quit but as i showed you the last two wins i just want to say i am absolutely loving first owner fiesta it is so good for this series it allows me to get some very very good packs for, at least can get me fodder for like you know your year and views or, you know, if there's any party bags and potentially heroes and icon packs. So the fact we've been able to do a hero pack already, as well as the few Euro review packs, is absolutely unreal. And yeah, we, we finished the gameplay off with an own goal as that gives us win number seven. So as we get all of the objectives claimed, all of the play seven wins seven. Now, I still wish those would claim all button, but unfortunately there's not. There's also a few other milestones and objective packs that we get for other things unfortunately have to discard at bellingham because we don't we aren't allowed objective players only packs we then complete marquee matchups for second squad because i didn't realize there was a token in there and also then do the last day of the foot birthday daily upgrade we'd already got the, the group reward already so that gave us 12 packs to open a lot of not so great packs but you know it all gives us fodder, but in the end, we can throw into a load of upgrades and then potentially get something decent. Maybe not in this promo, because I don't think there's a, any chance of us getting anything out of, you know, your, your standard 80 plus upgrades. But if there's a, maybe an 84 times 5 comes that's reasonably priced or something like that, then maybe we'll see. But yeah, as we've opened the poor packs, we'll chuck over to Live Bongo for the better packs. Mega pack, can we get anything? We get an informed walkout. Come on. Belgium, centre back, who's this? Toby Alderweireld, terrible for the series, not going to improve the team, but what an absolute hero. What a player, Toby Alderweireld. Good fodder. <laughs> Unfortunately. Right, in we go to the last seven packs. We've got 281s or 381 pluses from the daily login. Do we get anything? No board in the first one. Ramsdale and Ferran Torres into the second one we go anything in this one we get a board this time is it going to be anything special or is it going to be an 84 it's only an 84 Bonu and last one of foot birthday from the 81 doubles another board probably only going to be 83 this time and it's Jack Grealish and Henderson so a few decent packs left to go. 383s. Can we get anything in them? It's definitely boards, but I don't think it's a walkout. Nope. De Vrij. And not much else in there. A couple of 83s. And then another 83 double. Are we going to get anything? We get a walkout. France. Striker. Mbappé! It's I'm out of the pot. More good fodder. Not quite Mbappé. Then we've got 284 plus. Can we get anything? Probably not. It's just fodder at this stage. 284s, of course. And this pack, these packs have been absolutely awful. And 584 plus from the birthday cup. We get in for walkout again. Come on, Dutch. CDM. Genie Wine Holden. Yo, that card looks sick. He might have to go in the team instead of Barella, you know. That card looks sick. Bullet Club. I did not know he was even in Team of the Week. And Thiago Silva and two untradables. But that card looks decent. I mean, he's 25k. What? This is the team we're ending episode 10 and foot birthday with. Next episode will be based with Trophy Titans. If you have enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one.